All right, now I'm gonna walk by the car and casually glance at the screen. What the f Two, craft soft strip rangoon. Rang? <laughs> Why do you speak like that? <laughs> what up, everybody? My name is David Franco, and welcome to the weekend. Z vlog, D vlog. A vlog, a T vlog. I have a head cold, so I'm being responsible. Around the basically, parentis. basically, I'm trying not to taint mom and dad with my sickness. It's just a cold before all the COVID experts chime in. It's just a head cold, and it's winter, it's perfectly normal. Mom, what up? But just to be safe. Yep. Good job, Davy. Hi. I'm crafting. <laughs> what are you crafting? I'm making a sign. Just to put in the background of my what thing. What kind of sign? It's going to say inspire and create. I have to find the apperson. So you're not using the dream? Is that what it's called? Yeah. I don't think I have room. We're going over the order that we just hit for Red Lobster. Don't say address. Dad, what up? How are you? Okay, the Red Lobster order looks good. Pump. But who the fuck orders a cheeseburger at the seafood? Dad! Family's watched this. I'll do it again. No, I'm gonna keep who the, it. Who the heck orders a cheeseburger at a seafood place? Me, I wanna try it. Freak! Okay. <laughs> Two craft stuffed shrimp rangoons. Is that how you say that? Amazing stuff, too. One bacon cheeseburger. It's new. What's a wagyu? I have no idea. Okay. Baked potato, a uh, load of baked potato. Wagyu? One today's catch is mutated sea bass, which I love immensely. Yeah. Another baked potato, a load of baked potato topping, green beans. One lobster bisque. Who the hell ordered lobster bisque? Nice Man. shoes. Good job. Aren't they nice? I love these. Are they, are they new? To Justin Timberlake's. He I just the watched a Timberlake movie last night. So good on Apple TV Plus. Palmer, check it out, Dad. Actually, they are new. No shame. I cried in the end. It, it's it's a tear jerker. You would you would love it. And then I got a free key lime pie because of my reward points. Surprisingly, it was not that bad. The delivery charge who's who's DoorDash? Yeah, five bucks. It would probably cost me two dollars. DoorDash in those places are gas wise. So that's pretty decent. That's decent. And it's Red Lobster, which is always that. always really good. Uh, if I want to just about your leaves, tips for now, tips for later, what you need, I auto thing all my stuff. Anyway, DCD is doing very, very well. <laughs> Lots of job opportunities just came up. My son and I were going to be doing a, a how many stories is that? 50 my son something? It's not 50 some stories. My son 60. And I. It's not 60. I think it's 52. I think it's 36. Oh, oh yeah, I think it's 36. You guys want to have shots? But it's hundreds of rooms. Hell yeah, we're gonna have shots. Hundreds of rooms. We're definitely having shots. But we're not going into all the rooms. But you're just not gonna advertise when we have shots. <laughs> no, tell them about the COVID rules. Go. Oh, I know. Any, any. Okay, basically, it's a high-end condominium, high-rise. Um, any resident that has COVID, uh, we don't go in those rooms. Or had COVID. Or had, or, or yeah. under quarantine, we won't do it. We won't go in those rooms. And they're paying us quite a bit of money to. Go so in and push a button to that? test the smoke detector. It's pretty fun. Well, it's a fun job. And we're going to Uber Eats and DoorDash at night. Two nights, probably. Yeah, because we don't go out in the streets of Philly. No offense. It's not safe. It's very safe. City brotherly love my ass. The, the poor Wawa is gone. Calls it to shut because of all the crime constantly happening over there. Stupid. We get a lot of crime in Strasbourg, too, to be fair. No, we don't. The Amish Mafia. Yeah, the Amish Mafia is run rag ragged. Personally, I'm more of a New York City guy. Same. Yeah, I won't, even, I won't be near Manhattan until I get it cleaned up. Why? Because of politics? No, People. because the mayor oh. is a douchebag and everyone says that Republicans and Democrats can't stand him. And the governor's an asshole. Even Ellie said that he does not like the governor. Dad, can you ever not get political? I'm not getting political. Just chill, dude. They're chill. Destroying, they're destroying the city. Oh, I know, yeah. You should You should never do physical damage. You ask your buddy, Eli, Eli, what's his name? Ellie. Ellie. You ask your buddy, Ellie, what he thinks of what the governor's doing, or what the mayor's doing in Manhattan. I don't know sure. what's going on. Just I don't get follow his it. Opinion. Get his unbiased opinion. I'll tell you. Ellie, comment below. It's, it's or F, just or it's just F'd up. Or just text me. It is effed up. Anyway, yeah, I'm not. I'm not a huge fan of Philly. Cause I love Manhattan. There's a, 
It, it sucks too, because there's a lot of history at Philly. Yep. But it's not really safe to go there right now, is it? Oh, hell no. New York City, though, that, that place doesn't scare me at all. Yeah, but uh, New York City is... New York, I know, I know. New York City is now about the level it was in the 70s and 80s when they had the red light district and everything, and crime. There's no respect for the police officers. It's ridiculous. Well, Awful. the law, the governors and mayors should do something about that. Of course they should. Look, I just have to find an app or sand. Let's get the vlog back on track. I have to find an app or sand. Tell me. To put it right here? Yeah, don't touch it. You didn't touch oh. it, did you? Yeah. yeah, I did. Oh, no, 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 not the letters. Okay, good. They're here. No. Are you going to let, oh. Ah, what's that? What? what? Is that yours or my computer? Yours. Will you bring it by when you're done? Yeah. How does it do real time? Does it automatically reload? It's 2021, Dad. <laughs> no. <sighs> Stop. There was a tatch, It's still there. It's still in there. Okay, don't pull Stop. it like let me that. Get it. Let me get it. Just the audio alone of this makes people wonder, what, what are you, you doing? What are you doing? Are you pulling mom's what hair? Okay, no, I'll get it. It's more right. wash day. I, I, don't, I don't mind wearing a mask, but... You bought some pretty expensive well, Wearing one in the house in sucks. That's a smoke CO detector. That's like a $150 detector, Dave. I'm impressed. Look how huge this Clorox <laughs> thing is. Yeah, Alright, guys. What? Let, let's go over to mom and dad's house. What happened? And open what? some Pokemon cards. I forgot I ordered a bunch of Pokemon cards from Walmart, and they, and they came today. What a nice surprise. And I have a package from Miniature Market. I got the alert days ago. Heidi, I'm pretty sure that's from you, because I'm a UPS, sorry, my UPS, I think it's called, my UPS customer. So basically, like, if a package is coming to my house, I, I get an alert days ahead of time. And I looked up this Miniature Market, or whatever it's called, and it's a lot of, like, Pokemon stuff or whatever, so I'm excited. Let's go. Really? Dad always thinks we're gonna get robbed. Hi, Anta. Yeah, you locked it. You're paranoid. I am. I, I work in security. I know. Hi, Anta. <clears throat> How you doing? All it takes is one home invasion, and that could change your entire life. I know. Hi, Hunter. Hey, Fire. Hey, Timby. You look tired. Sorry, guys. I, I can't interact with you too much. You carry germs. You carry them germs. What's up, Odd? How you doing? You're so pretty. All right. Let, let me do an unboxing. Oh, shoot. Side. Dad, we'll figure it out. Okay. In that box is Mom's iPhone 12. We'll take a quick look at it. Do it. It's actually going to be put on the Xfinity Mobile. I don't know if we can show that. Oh, that's a SIM card. Okay. Well, no, there's a number on there. Can you can you hide the label? No. Okay, there you go. Oh, anyway. Very nice. Oh, wow, small box. Oh, oh. You know why the box is so small? Well, there's no power. There's no charger. There's, there's no power out there. Wow. You can get one. Well, I, I get it. Because most people have. Exactly. Thank you. A and ton it's of, terrible. A terrible ton. for the environment. There you go. We have one right here. See, look at that. So stop I think, whining. I think they give you the cable, though, at least. Yeah, yeah, they do. So, yeah, we'll do that tonight. And we should be able to take Mom's SIM card from her phone to put it in here because we're having trouble with the Xfinity account right now. I tried to put my phone, which was an AT&T. I unlocked my AT&T phone today. But for some reason, the account isn't set up on Xfinity Mobile. So we don't quite know what the heck's going on. And you're going to Xfinity Mobile. Why? Explain. It's way cheaper than AT&T or Verizon. And it actually jumps on the Wi-Fi towers and it does nothing acceptable in the area. It goes to Verizon, and Verizon is the... Bad. Yeah. She just looks back. Hey, you're so Verizon pretty. Verizon is the best carrier, as far as reception goes. Coverage, too, right? Yeah. Okay. Although, I'm very, I'm very happy with at and Here we go. Christmas candy. I got these in. Show them off. Pokemon cards. Are they both Ponita? They are. They're both Ponita. That's okay. It's, it's just a promo card. And this, I think, is from Heidi. 
this is a gift from someone. Do you have a knife? I'll just rip it. Actually, no, do you have a knife? No, I'll just rip it. Yeah, do you have a... No, I'll, just... no, I'll rip it. Oh, right, pizza cutter. Oh, thank you. That's perfect. Oh my god. Beautiful packaging material. Dude, I am keeping this. Look at this. Incredible. Yo. What's in here? Alright, let me take this off temporarily. I'm good. I'm good. Oh, it's another binder. It's the same exact one that I have coming tomorrow. Wait, did I order this? Or is this a gift? Yeah, it's from, it's from Miniature Market. Heidi, this might be from you. I'm not sure because there's no notes. But whoever sent this, thank you very much. So I do have this exact binder coming tomorrow, which is a good thing because I need more. I need more binders. This one's going to be for burning shadows, I think, because it's gray, burning, smoke. So I try to relate colors to the uh, sets. So thank you very much to whoever sent this. I appreciate it. And actually, I'm going to start organizing this tonight since I'm not streaming tonight. Yes, I officially announced it on Twitter. All right, let's do some quick pulls of these Pokemon cards. All of these are Sword and Shield base set. And if you guys want to fast forward, then fast forward. I take no offense. Boom. There's your code. I'm going to throw this out, so use it while you can. There you go. Very nice. And your promo card is Bonita. And you do get another coin. I think this one's Pikachu, right? Yeah, Pikachu. Very nice. Although it looks like Pikachu. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Not bad at all. God, my nose is itchy. And we have three more Sword and Shield packs. Here's your promo code. Enjoy. And another Ponita. I, I didn't get to pick which ones they sent me. Um, it's just a gamble. But I didn't get them for the Ponitas. I got them for these packs. So let's open them all really quickly. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six Sword and Shield packs. I'm going to make this really quick for you guys. And plus, I just got done opening like 30 packs at home. Okay, Snom, I have that. Oh, wait, let's do the trick. Here's your code. Enjoy. One, two, three, four. All right, Energy, Corvus Squire, Galvantula, Galarian, Leon. I don't know if I have this one. I'm sorry, I said Leon. Lie no one? Lie noon. Probably lie noon. I don't know if I have that, actually. I probably do, but I'm not sure. Snom. Grookey. I don't have Grookey yet. Okay. I actually got a new one. Very nice. Shelder. I don't have that one. Maywile. Galarian Ponita. Baltoy. And, oh, we have a full art, guys. First pack of the night is a full art. What's it going to be? <gasps> a Snorlax VMAX. Dude, wow, I think that's a really good one. I'm pretty sure. I just pulled the Snorlax VMAX. Dude. All right, I gotta look this up real quick. What's it gonna sell for? Go down the sold. Did you open your box uh, Like $6, $9, $10. But if you get a PSA, you can sell it for like 150 I think. What's that mean? PSA is when you send it in for them to verify the grade, like PSA 10, PSA 9, and they seal it and everything. So there you go. Look at that. What a nice pull today. You did them all? What are you doing? You did them all? No. Uh, it's the first card. Uh -huh. I'm getting really mad right now. It's your camera. Come on. There you go. Very nice. Look at that Snorlax VMAX, guys. That is... Beautiful. I did not expect to pull that tonight. And that's number 142 out of 202. So Yamper, Skorupi, Clavipus, 
I didn't do the card trick because I'm an idiot. Wulu. Sobble. Ooh, reverse hollow of rare candy. All right, I like that. Another full art. Are you kidding me? And it was Snorlax. Here we go. Okay, so it's a basic Snorlax V. Two Snorlaxes in a row. Dude. I actually might like this one more. And his move is uh, Swallow. I don't understand how you know what's good. There's a lot of jokes in that attack. We have Green Energy, Doug Trio, Pokemon Center Lady, Energy Retrieval, and there's your code. I can't believe I got two Snorlaxes. Did they really bubble wrap your cards? No, that's a, that's a binder someone sent me. Okay, guys, I'm gonna open these in my own time, like right now, and then I'll turn the camera back on if I get anything good. Th this camera is great for vlogging, but it's not good for opening cards. All right, so as soon as I turn the camera off, I opened up another pack, and this was in there. Another full art, three full arts in a row. Ndd V, very nice. Number ninety one out of two o two. So that is three full arts out of six packs. Not bad. Not bad at all, guys. Especially the Snorlaxes. This one's amazing looking. But I think this one's better, maybe? Not not uh, value-wise. But overall design. Waiting on Red Lobster to get here. But yeah, this is a beautiful card, guys. And here are the codes I did not show previously. So use them. You're welcome. Guys, the food has arrived. I am so curious about this burger. I honestly forgot I ordered it. A burger at a seafood place is very, very interesting. So, there's a stuffed crab rangoon. This stuff's amazing. Cheeseburger, salmon, baked potato, baked potato, more crab rangoon, mm -hmm. biscuits. What's all that? Oh, I guess this is soup. Oh, Let's your soup, lobster bisque. Oh, and green beans for dad. Green beans? Yes. Gotta have your greens. I'm so curious about that. Oh, look at all the crashers. No, 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 I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not trying it. I'm not trying it. I'll put it in the little thing for No, me. no, 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 no. Hey, Timby. You have fun with the bag? Yeah, look, it comes with it. What's he smell? Look, Just a fish? With, look what it comes with, David. That's so cute. Aw. Autumn, be one. cool, be polite. This is our food, not your food, yo. Right, beat it. Alright guys, here we go. First taste, like truly a first taste. This is a half a portion. Cheeseburger, bacon this cheeseburger like foil. at Red Lobster. Very fishy if you ask me, because you never know. Mm-hmm. Look at that. Look how thick she is. She? And look how greasy the brioche bun is, Mom. Oof. So here we go, guys. So catch your excitement. Cheers. The, the bacon is a little floppy, I, I will say that. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Not bad. Good? Yeah. It's good. It's solid. It looks good. Honestly, it, it tastes like a Cracker Barrel burger. That's good, right? Mmm. -hmm. It ain't no Red Robin now. Yeah. Because Red Robin, they know all yeah. burgers. That's solid, though. What the hell do you do with our biscuits? Mm. Sit on them? Not bad. I think you sat on our biscuits. But, the star of the show, the crop rangoon, mm -hmm. with this orange sauce, what are they, it's like a buffalo or tangy, I don't know. I'll heat them up soon. Hey. Mmm. Rudeness. Darn it. Okay. I'm not going to cry. Um, where's the sour cream? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> that was terrible. Guys, it's 10.30, exactly. 10.30. Dad and I ended up watching Ready Player One on Apple TV. He liked it a lot. He the especially enjoyed the Atari 2600 references, which is pretty cool. This mask is huge. Come Funny enough, face. I think I enjoyed the movie more the second time. Interesting. That happens sometimes. I said the more, didn't I? I enjoyed it more the second time. There you go. 
I, mean, I didn't I didn't dislike it. I just thought it was overhyped. It was it's a, it's a solid movie though. Solid. All right, going to the post office to drop off a Sony IR blaster. I sold it on eBay. Oh, good job. Little sale. Uh, talk to them about your weekend plans. Go. I'm taking the key. I got a little bit of indigestion from dinner. Yo. I think it's that soup. Red Lobster was. It's Turks. <laughs> Sorry. Guys, I'm tired. Here? I literally just stood in my carriage house for like three hours crafting. And before that, I probably stood for two hours. I got home from work at 4.30, and with the exception of coming home and eating dinner for like in 45 minutes to an hour, chilling, I've been at the carriage house. Crafting. Check out my Facebook page. I took a picture of everything I made tonight. I made another gumball machine. It's my last one. And Letizia, if you watch this, I went to Target again today. Oh, David got something. And no gumball machine, sadly. The one I did tonight was one that I started already. I had painted it. Now I just embellished it. But I'll be on the lookout for it. What is that? But yeah, we got plans. Oh, nothing really. I got out to breakfast tomorrow morning in our favorite place. Other than that, just stuff around the house. And Super Bowl Sunday. Snacks. I got a piece of paper. Snacks. Uh oh. Too large for your box. Dang, that's what he said. <laughs> <laughs> Ew, my nose. <laughs> that's good. Good job. I would bump you, but in terms. Well done. Well played. <laughs> very nice. Very nice. So I, I gotta come back. You don't. You don't feel like coming here tomorrow, do you? Oh, Dad, I might. Will they let me get it? I don't know. Can you hold on to it just in case? If not, I'll pick it up Monday, because God knows I'm not going to wake up early enough yeah. tomorrow. Are you I'll sure? Yeah. Okay, because if it's the blonde one, she knows that. Yeah. She yeah. doesn't need proof. Yeah. Only if you can. If Fair not, box 66. If not, I'll stop here Monday and I'll the start... The article is too large. And I'll box. start the <laughs> pages only vlog. Okay. So... Or mommy take that when we leave. Either way it works. Thank you. Don't make it a priority. Only if you can. Okay. Dad and I are going out to breakfast. We'll practically go right past here. Okay. Oh, 66. Gotcha. So what did you talk about? Actually, I forgot to talk about the weekend so you just came in. Oh, I talked about what I did all night. I was in the carriage. You want to do it now? I said no big plans really except breakfast tomorrow, which I love our Saturday morning breakfasts. Be careful, Mom. We end up meeting our neighbors there. And then... I feel like Just an Uber driver. The house and Super Bowl. Got yeah, yeah. Snacks tomorrow. Go Phillies. I think we're, I think we're doing pizza. And what the, what fudge? the fudge? Nice <laughs> reflex, David. <laughs> that was beautiful. Did you see how fast I was with that? I did. Yeah, I love, oh god, I'm gonna go into the curb. Are we explaining today why we're wearing masks in the car? Wait, is that, is that a stop sign? It yeah. was. <laughs> oh well, doesn't matter. How long have you lived here? Three years, four years. You get mad at me, but I get you for it. This classifies as distracted driving. There's like nothing going on oh, here. Oh, oh. Really? No. Okay. Nothing Be going cool, on huh? here, guys. Nothing going on I'm here. I'm getting coffee and just going to bed. Good job. Well, I mean, like, I'm going upstairs, going to have a coffee from here, then maybe make one more coffee, then go to sleep. No, you're going to have this coffee no, no. and go to sleep. I'm going to work on my mouth. Oh, take some NyQuil. I'm going to, oh, I've, I've been taking that. Oh, good. Does it help? I think so. I don't know. Um, you probably have a cold, David. It's it it is a cold. It's not COVID, Mom. I'm not saying it's COVID. All oh, these people on Twitter, oh, oh, good test of a COVID. It's not COVID, people. It's a head cold that happens in the winter. <laughs> Everybody's it's a, got COVID. Guys, it just happened to be the day after I spent an hour or two shoveling outside in the cold. That is not a coincidence. My, exactly. My uh, throat. And it's been really cold. My throat dried up. That's a big sign of winter. And for those who don't know, winter is it's a it's a cold season. Oh. But just as a precaution, David's being very courteous yeah. and wearing a mask around us. Because I'm not an anti-masker. Just in case. Which is very responsible, David. Right, 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 right. Oh. Plus, I look good in a mask. Look at this. Right? Look at us. Look at this. Screenshot there, ready? Ah, we'll say. <laughs> is that you? That was a car. Is that your stomach? That was your car. No, I did. Where's your car? You zero.
Come here, Z. What do you say hi to the viewers? Come here. Come on, dude. Whoa, you're such a bookie. Hi. <laughs> Look at him, guys. He's such a cool cat. A bookie? A bookie? Who's that? Look. Look. They're watching you. Every week. Isn't it creepy? But isn't it great? <laughs> at the same time? Hi! Oh, look at that beautiful fur. Yeah. Come here, you. Come here. Oh, you're a good boy. You're a good boy. Oh, there's Maui. Maui's back. I'm gonna move my coffee before you knock that over. Hey, Maui. What's up, dude? Hold on. Maui, hi. How's your night? I had a great night, thank you for asking. Okay hey guys, play. Don't fight, just play. Here we go, here we go. Maui? Sarah's <laughs> like, I ain't having that. Yeah, Zero, wanna go to the basement? Yeah, he loves it down there. Yeah, and have fun. Guys, good time tonight with the family. I'm so sorry I didn't stream. Gaming's not a lot of work, obviously, but it is draining after a while, like all the talking and focusing on games. I know, I know, it, it sounds stupid saying it out loud, but when, when you're lightheaded and you're, you're, your hearing isn't what it normally is, and you just wanna chill, you know? You just, you just wanna chill, I mean, you can even hear my voice. So yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm gonna go upstairs and relax in my bed. First, I'm gonna take a shower down here, a nice, Hot shower, enjoy my coffee. I did get myself a little snack. I'm not gonna have breakfast or lunch tomorrow, so I figured this doesn't really hurt me. Plus I'm still, I'm still losing. I mean, sort of, I'm at my average of 178. And I'm looking thinner, right? I'm definitely looking thinner. Especially with my glasses off. As patrons can um, confirm, because this week I actually vlogged with my glasses off on Wednesday, which I definitely enjoyed. And yes, I did get my final prescription, if you're wondering. Nobody's wondering. Nobody at all. Uh, so I'm going to order my contacts probably Sunday into Monday. So that's going to be nice. Glasses are okay, but contacts are so much better in terms of looks. All right, guys. I'm done. Uh, oh, one quick note. Hold on. Let's, let's check this live. So this, I was thinking. I was like, wait a minute. What if this is the one I ordered? I just thought this was from a viewer, you know? Because it didn't come directly from Amazon. Yeah, so it came from a third-party seller via Amazon. That's why I was confused. That, that rarely happens to me. Like, if I order something from Amazon, it typically comes in an Amazon box. But th this is one of those instances where it did not. Hey, be cool, guys. <laughs> Zero, you good? Maui rubbed his head up against the bowl where the water is. And the water went like, so it just scared Zero. Okay, no, wait, hold on. See, it's still, oh, deliver today. I'm an idiot. This is the one I ordered. I am so stupid. I am so, so stupid. Hey, you can't blame me, you know? Because, again, I'm just so used to Amazon, like, branded packages. So, cool. That's for Burning Shadows. Very nice. And if you look at the rest of my history, I have an orange one coming. That's for, um, I think, Sun and Moon. And the yellow one is going to be for Vivid Voltage. Imagine focusing in 2021. Just absolutely incredible, incredible performance tonight, Sony. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Happy Saturday, everybody. Cryptocurrency is doing quite well. I'm up $140 today. Thank you, Dogecoin. And I'm playing me some Star Wars, Jedi Fallen Order. Can't tell if that was a southern accent or me just talking like a baby. Baby both. I'm a southern baby, y'all. Today's a chill day. I mean, for me, it's going to be a chill day. I need to build the cubes. The white cubes that came, I don't think I even showed you guys. Ordered them over two weeks ago. Target took forever because the first one was never picked up due to some kind of processing error. Thankfully, their, their chat support was amazing. I was done within like two minutes. And uh, they sent the new one. So, the cubes are in my office. I'm going to build them today. And it's going to be so good looking. So, so good looking. Because I'm going for that white vibe. You know, I'm all about the white furniture nowadays with um, a 
dark gray wall. So I think it's going to look really good. Plus, my home bonds are going to look really good on them. Anyway, just enjoying some of my coffee, some gaming. Love me some Game Pass. Xbox has been adding a lot of games to Game Pass lately. Seriously, if you don't have Game Pass, you need it. And I wish they were paying me to say that because I say it all the time. But seriously, it's it's that good. It's that good. So, um, yeah, I mentioned my Dogecoin is doing well. If you guys want to trade cryptocurrency 24-7, 365, check out my Robinhood link right below. Yes, I'm still using Robinhood. I'm not jumping ship. I mean, come on, it's an easy platform to use. I don't, I don't really have any real issues with them. Um, it is what it is. I'm going to stick with them because I like them. They do a good job. What else? I'm gonna go sourcing for Pokemon cards today. Nothing too crazy. Nothing too crazy. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta tone down my spending on those. Pokemon's a very expensive hobby, that's for sure. But yeah, I'm gonna hit up Target. Maybe Sheets for dinner. Maybe Wawa for dinner. I don't know. I don't know. Um, and just relax. So yeah, the less I talk, the better, because my voice is part of the whole this uh, whole thing. <coughs> Excuse me. But uh, yeah, I mean, I went to bed by like 3 a.m., which isn't bad. I could have easily fallen asleep like 12.30 in the morning, but I quite literally forced myself to stay up with, with coffee because I hate going to bed early. just wanted to get some things done on my MacBook, and thankfully I did. Last night was productive. It was. I and mean, it wasn't like insanely productive, but it was productive. I just like to stay busy. You know, I hate being lazy. I hate sitting around and doing nothing with my time. So to do this, this is kind of like a luxury to just sit down and enjoy some Xbox. But I am streaming tonight, definitely. Also, I got a brand new shipment of San Francisco Bay coffee waiting for me in my kitchen. This is not San Francisco Bay. This is Dunkin' Donuts, which I believe... Gina, Christine, did you send me the coffee? I tried not to get my gifts mixed up, but whoever sent this, thank you. Thank you, I appreciate it. You're keeping me going, you know, you're keeping me going. But yeah, 120 single serves, San Francisco Bay arrived today. Guys, I'm gonna link that coffee right below. I always like it right below because I, I truly believe it's some of the best single serve coffee you can find. Seriously, it's so good. So, so good. Treat yourself. I look like crap, don't I? Yeah, I do. Hopefully I'll be back to normal by Monday. All right, it's time. I finally made progress in Star Wars, so that means I can play it tonight. I don't like getting stuck on long, confusing puzzles on stream because one, it frustrates the hell out of me, it makes me feel like an idiot, and two, I don't want the chat room watching the same shit over and over and over again, you know? So I'm so glad I beat that part off stream, which means I can play it tonight, stress free. Got my coffee, this is the shelving unit I'm building, love it, eventually that's going to be covered with an area rug. Guys, I'm serious, this is the last big piece. To my office besides this eventually this will be replaced but honestly it's kind of in its own corner so i don't mind it not being white you know it is what it is but yeah this is the last big piece before moving on to my gaming room yes enough talking about it and finally actually doing it there's a very good chance i'm gonna be ordering my desk this week coming up by the time everyone sees this it might be ordered it might be here already uh, so that's going to be a huge transition, officially leaving Twitch behind me. Twitch has... Easy. Twitch has... I'll wait, I'll wait. As usual, the reflection's not nearly as bad as it looks on camera. This camera's just trying to compensate for exposure. Anyway, Twitch has treated me very well. I've, I've been quite successful on Twitch as an affiliate. Um, but it's time to move on to YouTube. Yeah, they have a they have a puppy over there. That's so cute Adorable puppy. Oh my god people ask me all the time. Am I interested in getting a dog here? No, nah, no, nah, this is this is a cat household plus the less I have to worry about the better All right Let's get the building baby. Let's go and I took my temperature. I'm 97.1. Okay So here's a preview of what to expect if you're gonna buy this for yourself There's the manual all the hardware and all the pieces. It should be a fairly easy build. I actually have something very similar to this in my closet, which I'm not going to show you right now because it's blocked. But uh, yeah, these, these cubes should be great. And of course, I'm going to improve the cubes over time with, with some LEDs and some uh, color. 
like that might go in the cube somewhere or this plant right there that one it's gonna look good trust me it's gonna look good I'm just so glad so glad my office is finally coming together I mean guys look at this my iMac setup has come such a long way in a few weeks thanks to this desk I love my autonomous L-shaped smart desk the cable management is incredible look at this and I'm gonna talk about this in a video very very soon I love that cable tray and this portrait display just kind of completes it for me. And yeah, I have a lot of... I'm not going to watch this movie. I'm going to watch something else. I have, a, I have a lot of Pokemon cards to sort through. This is my favorite pool from yesterday's video. Look at that. Mega Venusaur EX. Very nice. I don't know what I want to watch, but I definitely want to watch something in the background. Because God forbid I ever uh, build something without entertainment in the background, right? I love Plex. I literally have thousands of movies to choose from. Love it. It's so good. And if you look underneath my TV, you can see my old black paint underneath there. See that? Yeah. I gotta, I gotta touch that up. But with that said, this TV is not going to be in here for an insane amount of time throughout this year. I'm hoping to replace this with the 65 inch that's in my living room. But more on that in a bit, not a priority. What do I want to watch, guys? Come on, help me out here. What do I want to watch? I still know what you did last summer? Okay, cool. Good choice, good choice. Not like a good movie. Hold on, did that get a 7%? Holy crap. It actually got a 7%. That's embarrassing. I like it. It's one of those tongue-in-cheek horror movies that's just fun to watch, you know? It's not necessarily good, it's just entertaining. <laughs> And we are done. That was an incredibly easy, an incredibly basic build. I don't know if they have anything that blocks that, the hardware from being seen. And now uh, I don't see anything. Not a huge deal, because I'm gonna put stuff on top of here anyway. Actually, my home pods are probably gonna block them. Or so, I don't know, I don't know. It's not a big deal. It would be nice if they gave you something now. Oh well, okay. So, yeah, it's done. Come on, Plex, what are you doing? All right, so I want to give a shout out to, oh, look at Plex doing its typical thing. I love Plex, but dear Lord, get it together sometimes, seriously. That should fix it. I want to give a shout out to a patron who said this furniture is great, but building it is a pain in the ass because gluing those little wooden things, I forget what they call them. Tip for you guys, you don't have to glue it. Seriously, I have built numerous pieces of furniture, mostly the cubes that use those little wooden things, right? You don't have to glue them. I've never had an issue skipping that step. You don't need to glue those things. Um, I wanted to see if I could find it. I don't know, I can't find it. It's somewhere around here. But yeah, Old Man PJ, I think that was your name. I'm, I'm sorry you were so frustrated with, with the build, but um, yeah, for anyone who buys this furniture, skip the glue. You don't need it. Yeah, I just can't say that enough. Time is money, guys. Save yourself some time. Work smarter, not harder, right? All right. It's looking good, guys. I think it's almost identical to the one I have in my, off, my um, yeah, office closet. Well, technically office. This one's a little thicker up top. This one's a little thinner, which is fine. Uh, but I wanted a good height because I don't want the home pods to be as high as they are now. Because again, eventually I'm gonna have a 65 inch TV, which is gonna come down to about here, and I don't want the home pods visually blocking the TV. So to have them this low, I think it's good. That's like the perfect kind of height. And by the way, if you're not using dual home pods on your Apple TV and you're using TV speakers instead, please do yourself the favor and make the switch. Now, yeah, I realize the average person doesn't have two HomePods, let alone one HomePod, because it's a little expensive. Trust me, I know that. But if you do happen to have two HomePods in the house and an Apple TV 4K, and you're not using like a sound bar or surround sound on a TV, hook up the HomePods and thank me later. It sounds incredible. Sorry, very reflective in here. The snow is bright. 
Speaking of snow, apparently it's going to snow again tomorrow and later this week. No, 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 no. Come on. Slow it down. But all right, there you go. Now time to take all of this down and transfer it with, of course, some more coffee. And there you have it. Some empty shelves. Except for the home pods, of course. Those should, in theory, stay connected. But yeah, look at that. Look at all that dust, too. And look at all this tech. That's a lot of tech, guys. Like, that's a lot of tech. And most of this tech I just don't use anymore. I just like to save it to put on display. I still know what you did last summer. Even got an airport over here. Mac Mini. iPad Pro, iPad Pro. This is from a viewer. Pretty cool. And check it out. If you use the old remotes, they still work on the Apple TV. See that? It's pretty cool, right? And even this one. Because it's just an IR signal. That's all it is. See? Pause. And even pressing menu backs out. Nice, right? Love it. God, I love tech. But the best one by far is the Siri remote. It's got its issues. Trust me, it's got its issues. But functionality-wise, it's the most high-tech one. Plus, it's got a built-in microphone, which I actually use all the time. All right, time to get all this transferred. I'm so hyped. All right. I think adding this green to this shelf really, really brings out some nice color. This I don't know about yet, but yeah, so originally all these cameras were on the shelf that was there, but I figured with my YouTube play button over here, it makes more sense for all the cameras to be over here, plus black and brown work very uh, well together from a professional standpoint. So that's what I have for that. And boom, how's that look? It's looking good. It's a little low, it's a little low. Shout out to Lau, or Lara, right? But isn't your nickname Lau? I'm just currently watching our stream, but for now, let me just mute it or close it. Excellent stream, Lau, thank you so much for uh, doing that. So this is what I have so far. Not bad, not bad. There's a good chance I might treat myself to a couple HomePod stands. Which, yes, are actually a thing on Amazon. Just just search HomePod stands, and they look quite elegant. But for now, this is great. Also, you have to keep in mind, I'm going to say it one more time. Because eventually I'm going to get a bigger TV here, it's going to better fill the space. Uh, but for now, I think that looks great. These are temporary. I might get a couple gray ones at Target tonight, which I'm actually going there soon. It's already past 6 o'clock. And look at this, guys. Cryptocurrency is doing well. I'm up $347 today. That is good. That is really, really good. That's why I love cryptocurrency. It trades 24-7, 365. You don't have to wait for the markets to be open. Okay, anyway, David, focus. We got books on the bottom. We have nothing in here. These are purely for filler, for uh, visual purposes to block the outlets. But yeah, I think I'm going to get gray ones. There's my newest iPad mini. Isn't really that new by today's standards. There's my original. I think it blends in well with the Space Gray HomePod. There's my white HomePod next to my Nest camera. My old Apple Watch, which I just put in there. And there's my older one, which has been in there for at least a couple years now. Got some extra magic mice, my Apple Pencil, Apple TV stacked on top of my Airport Extreme, and I think a dead Mac Mini. That was my dad's old Mac Mini. I'm still not sure what's wrong with it. Uh, down here, I have my Newton's Cradle. I know, I know. It doesn't make sense to be enclosed in that space, but I don't really use it. I mean, for me, it's just visual, you know? So yeah, for now, I think it looks good just filling up some space. Got some older phones. Not really old. I just don't use them, like Pixel 5G and all that stuff. Echo Dot. Old Nest. Um, earphones I've reviewed. And all my books, which I always like the books on the bottom for two reasons. Number one, stability. Having that much weight on the bottom just adds to the overall stability and infrastructure of the cubes. And number two, visually speaking, heavier things should be on the bottom. That way it kind of like naturally flows up to the lighter colors, white, and um, smaller black items. So yeah, I think it looks great. I think it looks really, really nice. Definitely more pro than before. Definitely more minimal. I might even take some things off the top shelf 
because I think maybe I have a bit much. For instance, the Airport Extreme, I don't think blends in too well, so I might just take that off and put it uh, in the in the closet. Um, I might take one Magic Mouse off, or maybe two Magic Mice, I'm not sure. Oh, and my iPod Hi-Fi is up here, which currently isn't plugged in, but I think it acts as some really, really nice visual weight to kind of just tie it all together, right? Have some old remotes just for decoration. And this is an iPhone 4 or 4S? I think 4S? I'm not sure. I bought that a while ago specifically for this. It was like the last iPhone with the 30-pin connector. So, very cool. And yes, this does work. It's just not powered on. But man, does it sound good. Does it sound as good as the HomePods? Of course not. The HomePods sound incredible. Steve Jobs is down there in the corner for now. And I did tidy up my desk a little bit. Still have a ways to go. God, look at that. Man, what a good day. Thank you, Dogecoin. God, I love you. You, you see, Seriously, it's making me money on the weekend. Look at that. $412. Guys, start investing now. Please. Stop saying it and start doing it. Anyway, I didn't even get a chance to organize my Pokemon cards this weekend. So maybe I'll do that tomorrow, but realistically, I'll do it Monday and the patrons only. A block a blog. I stole my brand new Apple keyboard that I still have to open. But yo guys, I am legit happy with these changes. It's finally coming together. Look at that. That actually looks really good. Now I just gotta get an area rug. One small enough to kind of fit through here. Just like a narrow one to kind of like fill the room when you walk in, you see it. And you're like, oh wow, that's actually really nice. Oh, and all my Pokemon cards are down there currently in the uh, binders. Like I said, I'll worry about them on Monday. Despite being sick and feeling lightheaded and dizzy and dehydrated and... Because all that coffee, come on, it's my fault. I still got work done. Like I said, I, I, I can't just sit around all day doing nothing with my life. I need to be doing something with my hands, you know? So, boom. Today's project, huge success. All right. Let's go to Target. God, aren't portrait displays amazing? Look at that. It is so sweet. I am very, very happy with that. I might take some things off the top. It might be a little too full. Like the iPad Pro and some, yeah. I'll worry about it later. But yeah, fantastic start, guys. Productive day. Loving it. See you guys in the car. Oh, look at that booty. It just doesn't quit. All right, so I had to stop at Shazak Pizza. Mom and I were nice enough to pick up that package. Hold on, let me turn the light on. Back there. Stop. Can you even see that? Yeah, there you go. Heidi, I'm assuming that one's from you. Thank you so much. And guys, before I leave, check this out. Right behind me, baby. Right behind me. You see that right there? That's a white Tesla Model 3. That's the car I want. And I can see a little bit of light on in there, which makes me think Sentry Mode is on. So it's probably recording. And yes, when I eventually do get my Model 3, I will be having Sentry Mode on. Even for quick visits like this, or Target, or Sheets, you know? Because it only takes one idiot to, um, you know, vandalize or do something stupid to your car. There seems to be a lot of jealousy around Teslas for some reason. Because if you look up Tesla cam stories, or whatever it's called, there are quite a few people who key Teslas just because of the Tesla. How, how weak-minded can you be? You are never going to succeed in life if you're constantly jealous of others. Put the work in. Actually, I think these are the owners coming right now. So very cool. Which means they probably recorded me. And yes, I hope they did. I just think Century Mode, yeah, it's them. That's so cool. Oh, enjoy. One day I will have one. I will. And the thing is, I can afford it now. Like, I actually can. But I'm not ready. You know, I'm not ready yet. All right, there should be one more package in my P.O. box, a small box. The um, lady who works at the post office told my parents this morning. Yes, I'm wearing my mask just in case somebody was in here. Oh, look at that, I'll keep, oh my God. Another one or is that old? I'm gonna keep it in here just in case because my parents were just here today. Huh. I sound so bad with this mask on. Cool. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. Let's go open it right now. I love this mask design for its simplicity, but it sounds so muffled. Here we go. Ready? Huh? The Model 3 just left. 
Godspeed, little buddy. Godspeed. Hey, if you want some life, go for it. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You hear that difference in audio? Insane, dude. Insane. The thing is, I just need a mask like this, but thinner material. This is too thick. All right, here we go. This is from Mandy White. Are you related to Walter White? Also, I'm pretty sure these are Pokemon cards. I forgot I ordered these guys. These are Pokemon Sun and Shield. No, sorry. Yeah, Sun and Shield. That makes sense. Sword and Shield. Are they parking here? Why? Jesus. I'll just do it as a target. I'm in a mood. People, leave me alone. Let me vlog in peace. God, if you're a vlogger, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Why are you at the post office at 6 30 on a Saturday, dude? Then again, I'm here. All right, I'm at Target. I'm just in a mood because I don't feel good. I feel like I should have stayed home, but I need food. I gotta eat. And I'm not gonna DoorDash or anything tonight. I've been spending too much money on delivery. All right, now. Let's open this. Nobody bother me, all right? You stay over there. You stay over there. Horses, you stay in your stable. Let's go, baby. Oh. <laughs> oh, baby, baby, baby. This is worth the wait. Might look better without it. Yeah. Dear David, I saw this mask and thought of you. What perfect timing. I hope you like it. I love being a viewer and patron. Mandy. Love you, Mandy. Thank you. P.S. I found these mask lanyards and thought of your mom. Okay. Will you please give them to my birthday twin? Oh, you guys. I'm sorry. I'm having trouble reading right now. I hope your mom enjoys them. Thank you very much, Mandy. Love your name, by the way. So these are for my mom. Very cool. Face mask chains. I didn't even know this was a thing. So how does this work? I guess you just attach it to the mask so you don't lose it? I guess so. Very cool. But even cooler, Mandy got me these guys. Thunder Mifflin masks. How cool is that? Mandy, thank you very much. And it looks like they're official. NBC. Even cooler. Mandy, seriously, thank you. Your, your timing is impeccable. Because I was just whining about my other mask. How it's too thick. And yeah, this, this, is, this is more clothy. And look, a simple black one. Dude, Mandy, home run. Absolute home run. Incredible work. Thank you very much, Manny. This is so cool. So, so cool. How do I look? Dude, it's thinner too. Like my, my, my voice doesn't sound ridiculous. I, I just gotta loosen it a bit. I'm having really trouble seeing. Okay, so you gotta pull this out a little bit, I think. And you should be good to go. Manny, thank you again. Two masks. Boom, you're amazing, and thank you so much for your patronage. You know what, hold on. I'm not going to open these right now, but I just want to confirm that everything arrived. Yes. Oh, I'm so excited, dude. So, so excited. You can never have too many Pokemon cards, right, guys? Agree or disagree? Oh, you better agree. There you go, Sword and Shield base set. Very, very nice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine times ten. Ninety cards. Ninety cards. That is a beautiful thing. Very nice. Very, very nice. Like the kids watching me. He's probably like, Mommy, Daddy, that guy has Pokemon cards. Oh my god. Excellent haul, Mandy. Thank you very much. And myself, thank you very much. eBay. All right, so you're thinking, well, David, you just got 90 Pokemon cards. Are you still going to buy more?
will be ridiculous. You gotta be kidding me. They have like nothing left. Huh. <laughs> well, that sucks. I was just here on Wednesday, so it's not a big deal. Hold on. Maybe over here. Nope. There is one more chance though. Always oh, check the toy section. Absolutely nothing. Hmm. That's unfortunate. Yes, I'm using my iPhone. Maybe I'll start to do this more often if you guys request it. Let me know. I mean, there could always be cards hidden behind other things, but it's not looking likely. Maybe it will hit up Walmart. Walmart generally sucks for me, but maybe it's an ad they'll come through for me. All right, so Target was a bust for once. I mean, they usually have something in stock, like the trainer's toolkit, which I don't need. It's overkill. But hey, at least I have nine packs in the car right now, you know? Part of me wants to go to the dollar store, the Dollar Tree, but nah. I'm just gonna go straight to Target, uh, Walmart. One of these days I wanna learn how to speak like a freaking human being. I'm very, very hard on myself. Oh, so this trip wasn't a total waste, because one, it's always good to get out, get on your feet, get some, get some exercise in. And two, I almost forgot to buy these. I got two of these. The gray organization bins. So cool. Not bad, you know? You gotta turn a negative into a positive. Seriously, live by that rule. All right, I'm at Walmart, and what do I see? Another white Model 3. Dude, what is going on tonight? Oh. Look how flush the door handles are with the paint job. God, it's so good. And those are the aero wheels I'm getting by default. It's such a beautiful car. And it, it, it's not like overly flashy, you know? It's simple, modern, attractive, if that makes sense. All right, now I want to walk by the car and casually glance at the screen. What the f- <laughs> <laughs> Technology, you are you are testing my freaking patience tonight, dude. Anyway, <laughs> that was frightening, guys. I'm going to casually walk by the Model 3, glance at the screen to see if Sentry Mode is on. Not gonna vlog it though. That that just looks shady. All right, see you inside. Please, Walmart sucks with Pokemon stuff for me in my experience. But tonight, will they come through? Maybe. Probably not. Nothing. I'm not really surprised. I mean, I can always check the toy section. Yeah, there's nothing here. Man. Nothing. Maybe it will go to the Dollar Tree real quick. It doesn't hurt. I mean, it's on the way to Sheets. All right. And I'm at Sheets. I gotta clean my car. As expected. Dollar Tree didn't have anything. It is what it is. Yo, I struck out tonight, big time. But, <laughs> while I've been out, yo, Robin Hood is blowing up. I'm up $427. Look at my portfolio. That's how much closer I am to my Tesla. And speaking of, I just saw my third Model 3 in white tonight. Three of them. Dude. It's a sign. It has to be a sign. All right, so last week I didn't read through... My, my mom just texted me saying, definitely a sign, yeah. Um, last week I did not read through some YouTube comments because I was hanging out with Chris and Curran. Good times, good times. So let me read some comments from last week's vlog, whether they're positive or negative. Although I do have a zero tolerance policy. One negative comment and you get banned. Boom. Lauren Cookie, I responded to this already. I'm sure your dad would like that train ride too, or he has already been on it, I'm sure. Yeah, Lauren, plenty of times, plenty of times. My dad has been on that train more times than I have. And a boomy boom, Tracy Fluter. 
Tracy always posts nice comments. I like your new glass. I wore glass. I like Pokemon cards, too. I liked the video today. Tracy, I know what you're trying to say. Thank you very much for the positivity. Boom! Aaron, sorry, Eric. Eric, Kendra, K. David, I love that you're enjoying Pokemon cards again. My son and I collect as well. Have you thought about Magic the Gathering? Fun fact, I tried to get into Magic when I was a kid. I went to the Defert Mall. I went to some kind of card collecting shop, and I bought one or two packs of Magic the Gathering, and I just didn't stick with it, you know? I, I don't feel attracted to Magic like I feel attracted to Pokemon. Maybe it's my love for animals, but I, I love opening each pack and seeing all these different Pokemon, you know? And I, I, like, I like seeing all the different kinds of species and stuff like that. Playing Magic is awesome, and collecting is just as addicting as Pokemon. See, maybe one day I'll get back into it. But, and I say this in a positive manner, the fact that I can always find Magic the Gathering cards, and I can rarely find Pokemon, at least tonight, I think that says a lot. I, I don't think Magic the Gathering has the cultural backing that Pokemon does, but... With that said, I'm sure magic is great, you know? I'm just more dedicated to uh, Pokemon right now. I'm not, like, immediately subtracting that from my future, though, you know? There's always a chance I could get into it. Also, look at the Dex Protection Binders on Amazon. They are the absolute best binders I've come across. Cool, thank you, dude. I will. The velvet lining on the inside of them really set them off. Keep up the great videos. Thank you so much, Eric. The thing is, I'm very picky about my branding, and I really like Ultra Pro right now. And right now, I need all of my binders to match, you know, in terms of branding. Except for the Pikachu one, that one's completely different in terms of material and overall presentation. But that's because it's my Evolution set. The Evolution set, in my eyes, stands out amongst, I mean, stands out from the rest of the Pokemon sets. Excellent comment, thank you. Envy Project, I love what a Playco is. Oh, I'm mean, sorry, I know what a Playco is. See, I didn't. Maybe I'm an idiot. I don't know, I don't know. Thank you. Slimmy Jimmy, I would love to hear your thoughts on the potential potential Switch Pro. Maybe I'll make a video on that. Some quick thoughts right now. Switch Pro, which by the way, he's talking about the Switch console, Nintendo. The, the Switch Pro has been rumored for what? Actually, the Switch Pro has probably been rumored since the Switch even came out, you know? Um... Realistically, I don't see Apple... Apple, what the hell? I don't see Nintendo going all out in terms of like 4k visuals if anything maybe increased battery life or maybe the switch pro will be purely purely a home console that does not dock maybe it's its own thing that way it's completely dedicated to outputting 1080p graphics at 60 frames per second i would be okay with that like i don't need a switch console that comes out of the dock and yeah some people may argue, well, David, that goes against the whole name of the Switch, you know? But the Switch Lite, you can't dock the Switch Lite, so that's not really switchable in a sense. So, yeah, I mean, if you are my honest thoughts, and I think, oh, baby, I'm getting excited just thinking about this. Imagine a dedicated console where Nintendo is purely just thinking about graphics and horsepower and performance. Think of it like the GameCube all over again. Pushing those graphics, so Nintendo, please do that. Do I see that happening? Realistically, no, because this is Nintendo we're talking about, but that would be exciting. And Slimmy Jimmy, thank you. Maybe I'll make a video about that, because I think I think that would be an exciting concept just, just to talk about in its own video. Steven Crossman, I have two shoe boxes full of Pokemon cards, old and new generations. Working in my third one, absolutely love Pokemon, and I love the Pokemon video so far. Great job, bud. Thank you, Steven. Appreciate that. And one more random comment. Boom. Keith Caperso. Chris and Tiff got divorced. Wow, yeah. You know, um, I, I, I didn't want to put Chris's business out there, but Chris, I hope you don't mind my saying this. I mean, it's easy information to, you know, <laughs> discover at this point. Yes, Chris and Tiff are no longer together. Um, it is what it is. I think each person is better off doing their own thing. Tiff is doing her own thing. Chris is doing his own thing, and he's happy with Corinne. Um, so, yeah, let's just respect their privacy. That's the thing, when you put people's lives on camera, people are gonna ask questions. People get divorced. It's part of life, it's what happens. All right, one more comment. Heidi Hansen simply just posts hearts. Heidi, thank you for the positivity, I appreciate it. And I'm assuming that box back there is from you, uh, so 
I'll open that tomorrow. Okay, all that talking did not help my cold. Now I'm incredibly lightheaded. So I'm gonna go order some food, go home, and finally eat. I haven't really had a lot of food today. Are you surprised? You shouldn't be. Finally home. I'm so excited to open these guys. God, the excitement is always real. Ah, oh, I love it. I will give these to my mom tomorrow. I promise, I promise. Okay, okay. And the things I bought. Come on, baby. Boom. And a boom. I said, and a boom. There's my coffee, guys. Hi, Z. I'll get you, dude. Hold on. All right, these are going to go right in there. It actually doesn't look bad, but I just want something closer to the color of my walls. Very nice. What a good day. Got a lot done for a Saturday, you know? Gotta stay productive, guys. Stay busy. Stay active. Come on. Oh, you look puffy AF. Did you eat something? What'd you eat? Who did you eat? What was her name? You ate a turtle? How dare you? Nah. But there's definitely, I don't know, it, it feels like there's something in him. He's puffy. Hey, hey, hey! Let go, my dude! <laughs> what are you doing? Let go! Zero. <laughs> Chill. No, you're pulling... Hold on. Zero, I'm helping you. Come here. Zero. There you go. <laughs> he got stuck. Oh, you're okay. What's he get for attacking me, you know? That's what you get. Today's lunch or dinner? What's wrong with these, Zero? I should've got you cat food. I'm so sorry. This week, I promise. Tonight's dinner, marinara sauce. With some jalapeno boppers, baby. God, they're so good. And I was in the mood for some tacos. Sheets tacos are pretty good, guys. Give them a try. I got them because I thought they were going to be free since I had enough points. So I redeemed it. But I had a feeling this is the case. The points only apply towards the basic tacos. I got Supreme or whatever they call it. So unfortunately, I had to pay full price and I wasted my points. Sheets, if you see this, please refund me those points. You don't have to. It's my own fault. User error. Please. God knows I'm there enough. What the? So it was, those points will come right back. If you guys have ever tried vlogging, you'll, you'll know the struggles that we go through trying to do everything with one hand. Don't take both your hands for granted, guys. All right. Uh... Time to have dinner. All right, fine. Let's open one pack of cards real quick since my battery's dying. So this is Shored and, yeah, Shored. What the hell's wrong with me? Sword and Shield face set. I already see a Pikachu. Okay, so it's green, I'm learning, so it's nothing insane. But there's your code. One, two, three, four. Energy. Great Ball. Potion. Rhydon. Pikachu. Love that art of Pikachu, very nice. Sinisty, Wooloo, I don't have Wooloo yet, cool. Shelder, Grogunk, and a Goldeen Reverse Hollow, very nice. And a Claydol. Not a bad set, cool. Or a pack rather, a pack. All right, one more set, one more set. God, it's like a drug. I need more. Oh, another green one. Damn. That's okay. Every Pokemon is good in my eyes right now because I need more. Energy. Energy retrieval. Ferrothorn. Heat more. Yeah, I don't I don't have any of these. Hoot hoot. I think I have Pinter. Pincurchin. Volpix. I don't think I have that Volpix. Nicket. Baltoy. Mudsdale Reverse Hollow, very nice, and a Cinchino, cool. Most of these cards I don't have in this set, so, hey, okay.
Can't complain, right? Not bad. I'm tempted to open the rest, but no. Must be patient. Maybe after dinner, I'll open two more, okay? All right, so I just pulled all my cards. Got most of them in the pile. Hold on, let me show you my very last card. Let me put these over here. My very last pull for the night was this. A Lapras VMAX. Or Lapras. I'm just going to call them Lapras. Lapras VMAX Rainbow 203. I looked it up. On eBay, it's going for between like $20 and $50. Very, very nice. Am I selling it? No, 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 no. This is going into the collection. And actually, I just realized it's a secret rare. 203 out of 202. So technically speaking, it's not part of the collection. Hence, hence why it's a secret rare. Dude, very, very cool. And it was my last pull for the night. What are the chances of that? Oh my god, people on next door are so weird. Seriously, I don't know who just launched fireworks. Like, not even 10 minutes ago, there's this lady on next door already complaining. Who's setting off fireworks at this time of the night in February? I can't even. Oh, Londa, suck it up. Sir, I, I can't stand people like that. Let people have some fun this time of night. It's 9.30 on a Saturday. <laughs> well, like, what? That's the lady complaining about fireworks. She kind of looks like a Karen. Is it just me? And hey, Chicky Poo, lens is up here. Look up here. It's not that difficult. And I posted this comment word for word. You ready for this? I don't care. I'm always going to speak my mind. Uh, let me see. Is this what we do? We hover on next door waiting for something to complain about? Then I put the little laughing emoji to have some fun, you know? Just to have some fun with it. They're just fireworks. It's Saturday night. Let people have some fun. It, it's just amazing. Like, this literally happened within the last 10 minutes. And this Londa person immediately jumps on her computer and just has to complain on next door. I, I, don't, I don't get people, dude. I, I honestly don't get people. God, that makes me mad. Just silence yourself, all right? Go back to knitting your blanket and reading... Uh, what's that sexy book? Um... Fifty Shades of Grey. Yeah, go read your book and get off on that, all right? Don't get off on next door. Come on, baby. Come on. You know, I'm not even going to call you baby. You're not my baby. You're just a Karen. Moments later. I'm just watching a clip from tonight's stream. Pretty sweet play. You know, shout out to Flares. We got two wins tonight in Warzone. The clip I'm going to roll right now is just more of like a fun clip showing something that does work in the game. Like if you need a quick workaround for reviving your teammate um, in an awkward, unique situation, let's just say that. Yo, look how tired I look. You, you, you can't get up here, right? Can you try to catch me? Does that still work? Uh, yeah. Ready? Sure. Here we yeah. go. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god! <laughs> I did it! Fucking did it! That was amazing! <laughs> We've never oh successfully Holy done that shit. before. That was terrifying! Wow. Anyway, great stream tonight, guys. Got a really weird host tonight. People get aggressive. Like, people get so oddly aggressive. Let me just say that, but if you watch the stream, you know exactly what I'm talking about. But I deleted the stream already. I, I just didn't like how that went down towards the end. People get weird. Like, people get really, really weird. Uh, but yeah, really fun stream. So, and I'm not talking about you guys. I'm talking about people that came over from another person's stream via the host. It is what it is. Just so an awkward situation. <laughs> um, it's okay. It's just weird. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Uh, low battery. This is actually perfect timing, so I'll see you later today god i need sleep it is 6 19 in the morning i didn't expect to stay up this late you know being sick and all all right i'll see you later and i'm here we, what's up parentals we just had our own order of wings hi ma oh tell them some smell it's the meat lovers it's a bunch of meat together no, it's the wings oh that last means i snuck those in there Ooh, stick old poppers? Poppers. Dude, mom, thank you very much for this. I'm not a dude, but you're welcome.
so if you're wondering why I text you like 2, 3 in the morning, because yeah. I was playing with flares last night, I'm like, I wonder why I have her dinner. I'm going to just text my mom. Well, I did the same I'm thing I'm like, dude, that. she's not answering me. <laughs> but then I completely forgot today's a Super Bowl. Well, that's what I said now. That's why I have to go to the market and get something for dinner. I was like, yeah, this is Super Bowl. We'll do it Oh my god. So these are the good ones you like? Yep. Look at them all, guys. These are all for mom. <laughs> 36 of them. Mom's hungry. <laughs> all these are for you? Mm-hmm. I just get it. I just, I just want to show them. Mmm. Mmm. Show off that meat lovers, mom. Okay, dad loves jalapenos. He loves cheddar. Oh, dear lord, that looks good. Guys, doesn't it look good? Very nice, and I've had nothing to eat today, as usual. I'm all caught up on the the vlog. Yeah. I gotta try this. Where's this from? Two Cousins. Two Cousins in Paradise? Mm-hmm. I don't know if I've ever had the meat lovers. Mm-hmm. Hey, do you want a jalapeno popper? Oh my god. Mmm. Mmm. Yo. Really good sauce. What's up, Tim? By the way, guys, I'm, I'm feeling a lot better today. Like, a lot better. I haven't sneezed once. Mmm. We just watched We that. just watched that one. This is incredible. Is it? It's the sauce, too. The, the sauce mixes very well with the meat. Mmm. You want a couple wings, like 12? Please. Can I try a popper? Yeah, please. I'll, I'll dip only once. Mmm. Mm. I'll dip once, okay? Mm -hmm. So I'll put some in here. Okay. Here we go. I'm very picky with my poppers. Is the cheese finished? Mm -hmm. Like a runny cheese? Yeah, nice. Better? Mmm. Not bad. Mmm. Isn't it great watching me eat, guys? Mmm. We got all flats. Man, talk about a request. 36 flat wings. <laughs> Flat is the way to go. Am I right, ladies? Fat, well done. Mmm. Okay, these, these are better than the yellow place. Mm -hmm. mm. Imagine being vegan. I can't do it. Then, Heidi, I'm going to unbox your box. Sick. No, wait, wait. We had some box jokes on camera last night, too, on stream. You had some what? Box jokes. <laughs> Did a review, go. It's a football. Very good wings. The wings were amazing. Pizza was okay. Pizza was very good. good. <gasps> How dare you. I got the meat lovers for you and dad. Thank you. Guys, look at oh, this. It's all sticky. Hold on, don't take it out. A little ice cream cake action. Got a little plate. Actually, I gotta make that a plate. The Chiefs are getting killed right now. They ain't getting killed. But yeah, it's 14-3. But we still up. have half a game though. Half a game to catch up. It's a football! Oh, for the World Series. Very nice. Go Phillies. Or, or is it Mets? I forget he's playing. We're gonna take Bob and Norny's. Poison at first. Oh. Hey, Autumn. You're so pretty. Ain't getting that. By the way, guys, I would like to apologize for the focus sound of this camera. I don't know why I just started doing this, but I noticed that while editing in my car, the uh, camera, what? Why are you editing in your car? I know, the way I worded that, I was waiting for you to jump on me. Anyway, I noticed that while editing, the footage of myself in my car, it was like, cause like, I hate that sound. So I'm sorry about that guys, I'm sorry. Hopefully it doesn't do it again. I'm tired, by the way. Look at me. Is that enough, or should I get more? That's enough. Anything? I mean, they're good neighbors, but they're not like State Farm, you know? 
Just kidding. Okay. All right, Heidi, I'm going to open up your box. Stay tuned. Sick. <laughs> Get ready, baby. <laughs> Heidi, I got to say, you have a big box. And there's my P.O. box if you guys ever want to send anything. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Mom, you want to record me? Or should I just put it on the shelf? Just put it on the shelf. All right, I'll put it on the shelf. Put it on the shelf. I think I'll put it on the shelf. Put it on the shelf. My neck is red. Does somebody give me a hickey and not let me know? <laughs> How dare you, baby? How dare, How dare you? you? Sneak in there. Hey, Odd. Not your cool. You're such a cool key. You're such a cool Heidi, your box is big. Dave, don't be so rude to Heidi. Can I have a knife? Are oh, you having some now? No, no, unbox the uh, box. Oh. Yeah. Hold on. Too late. I'll just have this little tiny piece. Here we go. Oh, so disclaimer, I think Heidi said there might be some candy in here, uh, but she said we can just give it to other people because she forgot about my scaling back. But we'll see. It might be stuff I'll, I'll, I'll cheat with, you know? All right, can you hand me things as they come out? Yeah. I think I think it's like a big old care package, like random stuff. Oh my God. <laughs> That's a lot of stuff. Dorbs. Bye -bye. I like that. Gosh, you look like food Ooh, shopping for you. Cinnamon Crunch Cereal. I've never had this brand. It looks somewhat healthy. It's, yo, I'm going to have this tonight. Remind me to buy milk. Mm, I'm not going to have that tonight. Just a couple options you can have tonight. Really? Yeah. Heidi, thank you very much. You didn't have, Heidi, you had to get Watch me all cake. this. Thank you, thank you. Ooh, honey oats. Oh, sorry, honey nut toasted oats. Very no, nice. I think we're going to have these tonight. Happy belly. Thank you, Heidi. I think we're going to have these tonight. <laughs> Lucky Charms or? Nope. Yo, I don't know these brands. This is really cool. Gluten free. Berry Vanilla Puffs. Maybe. Maybe. Heidi. Yuck, you're gonna like these. This is such a random box. Yuck. Fruit? Oh, Vanilla Pudding. <laughs> One of my favorite. Oh, I snack know. pack. Heidi. You like that. Your box is incredible. Is that it? Nope. <laughs> Chocolate? Oh, more vanilla. Dude. <laughs> is that it? Nope. Is it Capri Sun? Is it a drink or food? I think he said the first time, which you said before. Fruit. Yep. More. Oh, cherry mixed fruit, thank you. I love, yo, I, I just had two of these last night. Not this exact one, but something like it. Thank you so much, Heidi. Huh, last one, I think you're gonna I don't like deserve this. all this. It's, it's like a food shopping trip. Last one, I know, I should have food shopping for you. So this is it, right? Yeah. All right, fruit snacks? Yep. God, I'm good, I can, I can tell by the weight this place is. Enjoy your gift. Black Forest, so juicy, so good. Like Heidi's box. Yeah. Thank you, Heidi. Organic. Happy late birthday gift. Enjoy it all. Hugs from Heidi, 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 Heidi. Oh, hugs, Heidi. Kisses. Send licks. Thank you, news. A little hump. Say, say, Heidi. Thank you. Very Black late Forest. Birthday gift. Enjoy it. So juicy. So good. Organic fruit. Very late snacks. birthday gift. Enjoy it. Very medley. Very late birthday gift. Enjoy it. I don't know why there's so many notes in there. Amazon does that, I think. Or no, I think she copy no, pasted this one. Yeah. Very nice. Copy the notes. Heidi, thank you so much. And I You're hope gonna you... take it home in the box? Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I just hit the cake. <gasps> it's okay. And I hope you had a great Christmas. I know it's just, February. It's but... good. I just, I just feel like I should still say it. She's and... like my food shopping for you. Thank you so much for all your support on Twitch, Heidi. And follow me to YouTube. Don't give up my streams, please. Oh, what happened? She stopped following you? No, no, no. Oh my God. Seriously, Heidi, thank you. you. You've always been so very supportive of me. Um, and I look forward to continuing our friendship throughout the years. Their shirt is loose, isn't it? It keeps falling down. You're awesome. Oh my God, guys. That was like the best Super Bowl halftime show ever. Let me go post on social media about it. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, wait, no, I don't like it. I was underwhelmed. Let me, let me, let me go on Facebook and... Get the assurance from people I don't even see in real life. That's what people do. Go ahead, Mom, rant. 
No, it's just be a good human. Exactly. Right. I am good sorry life. that you're sitting on your nice, warm, comfy couch, heat in your house, probably just got done stuffing your face all day with Super Bowl <laughs> snacks, because that's what we do. But you have to take the time to make sure the whole world knows that you didn't like the Super Bowl. Every year. I can't year. tell you how many posts I've seen already. It sucked. I won't yeah. see the other one. Horrible. I've seen blah, a lot blah, blah. of positive ones Comparing now. it to ones years ago. You know what? People get over it. People are dying of COVID. Be thankful you woke up and you're breathing and you were able to sit and watch the Super Bowl. Well said. I'm serious. I'm just so disgusted in the human race these days. People are entitled to their opinion. I get that. But exactly. People are entitled to their opinions, but it doesn't always have to be a negative there one. There are certain things you should just, just, just exactly. silence yourself Exactly. Like on. me. I didn't, know, I didn't know anything about this guy. Did I like it? Like the fireworks Probably. thing on next door. Remember I told you? We don't need to hear your complaints I about mean, fireworks. It was, he's an entertainer. It was yeah. entertaining, I guess. He's but, obviously very successful. And he seemed like a really good guy. I know nothing about this guy. He was good clean, luck. He was clean cut. It was family friendly. Because let's talk about all the years that the shows weren't family friendly. And everybody complained about that. How about just be grateful, a nice clean cut guy. Again, I don't know this guy. I don't know anything about him. But I'm so triggered right now, guys. I'm so triggered. And you know what? If it wasn't for my kids or how many craft people I follow, I would seriously get off Facebook right now because everybody abuses Facebook. It's like, and I'm sorry, I know you're entitled to your opinions, but you don't have to rush to social media and be the first one to say how you didn't like it or it wasn't good. Again, you got to watch it from your warm, cozy house. How about the people that are homeless and didn't get to watch the Super Bowl? It's just, I don't understand it. I'm sorry. Maybe maybe I'm wrong, but I just How was don't it? get it. Mom, I live on social media. I, I see just it don't understand. all the time. If you don't like it, that's fine. But you don't have to go post about it. There are two kinds of people in this world. And then that just engages in everybody else. People who appreciate and are grateful. And, and people, people that seek attention. Who just constantly complain about everything. I don't understand. Everything. I see it all the time. I don't understand. I mean, I'm not a complainer. Sometimes I complain. I'm Every, not a complainer. Everybody complains. I rarely complain. But I'm a, I'm a very positive person. And I person. conform. If I'm in a crowd of people, <clears throat> I conform with the crowd. I don't yeah. try to be like that person. Oh. I mean, I it's wasn't. Just human nature in general to me sucks it's like it's a me 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 society it's what i want it's what i need i didn't like that show because it wasn't what i well who gives a I crap know. what you need you literally How watched about giving a guy props for getting up there and doing it you literally watched a free halftime show can, exactly can you people sing like that do you want your no. money back yeah <laughs> you want a refund i'm sorry but i'm really triggered because you know what i for one am in so grateful to be alive, so grateful for life. I try to enjoy every living moment. I try to find a positive in everything. I don't wait for oh, the opportunity oh, oh. to go and negative. <laughs> As David gets triggered about his camera. I'm sorry I rant it, but. No, but I just, admit it. I'm not oh. trying to be like me, 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 but do you think I'm a positive? Mother, I hate this camera. You're a very positive Let's person, and no offense, you get it from me. I do. Because I raised you to be like that. I, I even, I even, what did I always tell you? If you don't have anything nice to say, don't say anything. Yeah. I, I even said, this is going to slide again. Oh, it's no, like we're people good, just good. can't wait to post it. That's what kills me. I know. Hovering over the keyboard. It's yeah, waiting for like the complaints. Just waiting for the last note so I can hit send. It's just annoying to me. Underworld. And they wonder why there's so much hate in this world. How about take the time to spread love? And that's spread the thing. joy. That, that, that's the thing, too. When, when you post some, exactly. some, it some negative like that. Stuff. It says it's okay to complain, so other people and complain. And then it brings everybody else out, and it turns into a big... Yeah. Blah, 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 blah. And then it makes others complain about those people, are off those, you know, it's a never-ending Like I said, never you're entitled chain. to your opinion, but my God, keep it to yourself. Or be like, okay, that show wasn't as good as such and such, but it was at... Yeah, yeah I didn't know anything exactly. about it, but it was entertaining. Like, if you don't like something, at least say why. Don't yeah. say underwhelmed. Say why you don't like it. Otherwise, you just look like an attention-seeking person i don't get it I me mean, neither really it makes it literally makes me sick to myself i've never understood the way it either, this society Mom. is going never understood it either because you know me i'm very outspoken if i don't like something i'll say why i don't just say i hate this i hate that it's just i don't understand life is too short to complain about things Again, that it's cold out there we're all really don't watch matter the Super Bowl for free in our house stuff our face all day with food have some good wings too exactly. let me tell you <laughs> but god forbid the super bowl show sucked 
I'm so excited to edit this later. Even people that I know and I admire. I saw a mm -hmm. couple people, even like people that I follow in my crafting world that I'm shocked went out of their way to say, well, that sucked. How about not saying anything at all? I asked this in a polite way. Were they older? They're my age. So I'm not, I'm not calling you old, but that's out of the generation the of the thing. weekend. Dave was the yeah. same way. Dave didn't enjoy it. And I even had words yeah. with him. I'm like, that's because you don't know I'm who like, he is. Dad, he doesn't appeal to you. I don't know who he is. And no matter what you do, you're not going to appeal to everybody. So how about just be like, Even when we had Michael Jackson, I'm sure not everybody liked Michael Jackson. Most people probably did, but a lot of people didn't. Exactly. No matter what, people aren't going to like something. It's just how it is. I just feel sick to my stomach because I don't understand people. I, I deal with this stuff every day, so unfortunately, I'm, I'm used to it. I just don't understand. I'm used to it. Why does it always have to be negative? Oh, I just went back and forth with uh, probably two or three people on Twitter because I said invest in Dogecoin. Some guy freaked out because I didn't put an investment disclaimer. Saying this is incredibly... I'm like, dude, I'm not going to put a disclaimer on every single tweet I talk about Dogecoin. You need to invest with common sense. And not right? just that, you're a nobody. You're like, just mentioning it. It's not like you work yeah. at the Wall Street. <laughs> like, if you're if you're a person with money and responsibilities, you need to invest responsibly. Oh, I had someone say a friend of theirs was in the process of buying their house. They lost their deposit because they invested in the GameStop stock and lost thousands. I'm like, dude, no offense. You should not be investing if you're buying a house. No, and you don't invest money you can't afford to lose. Like, for instance, what... Three years ago when I bought my house, I just stopped buying tech. Right. Like, I just stopped buying stuff right. I didn't really need. Right. And, guys, let me tell That's you. That's what you're supposed to do. If I was buying a house right now, I wouldn't be investing in Dogecoin. Trust me, I wouldn't be. No. Maybe, maybe a little bit here and there, but to lose thousands, that's just irresponsible. And I'm not saying that as a jerk. I'm saying that as a real-life so situation. so sad yeah. society is as a whole. Just be more positive. Be a good person. It's Everybody's really not that hard. to slip up so they can say something to you. Oh, I get that all the time. Ooh, on, Bob liked his ice cream cake. On Twitch and YouTube. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I have people hop, Mom farted. Oh, I have people goodness. hovering over their iPads waiting for me to say something stupid just, just, just to get at me. It's just how some people are. But fortunately, most people are good people. Oh, there are a lot Seriously. of good people out there. We, we have so many people on this channel constantly posting nice, positive comments. So thank you, guys. Thank you. And if you're one of those naysayers, just leave. I don't watch it. I here. love when I'm watching this one girl. That's when someone a hater gets on there and makes a comment. She's like, nobody's forcing you to watch That's me. That's the one I like, right? Yeah. She's like, just leave. <laughs> yeah. Just just get out. I didn't invite you to this channel. Yeah. You found me. Just leave. It's like, Life it's is thing. too short. I watch these crafters. They're all pure family. Most of them are Christians. That's the thing. We're pure. We're pure in family. Oh yeah. We we're, we're get, we get a little raunchy here and there. But, but I mean, okay. most of these people are Christians and good people, and and somebody will find something to say to them that's nasty, mm -hmm. and I don't get it. I don't get it. It's like, why are you watching me if you're just gonna say something negative? Let's get that coffee. Oh, Let's get that tea. He said so good twice. <laughs> Bob. Get it. Bob doesn't know how to text. <laughs> He's trying his best. Good talk, Mom. Seriously, good talk. We took our talk. neighbor some ice cream cake after the halftime show because that's what you do instead of going to the keyboard. Mandy, thank you so much for these. Dave and I are curious. Did you send this to me because I'm always losing my mask? <laughs> I'm always finding it in the driveway because it's on my lap. This right? This is amazing. I'm going to use this tomorrow. So wait, how does it work though? It clips on your mask. And do you put the lanyard around your neck or you yeah. just tie it to something so you don't forget? Or any way you want to use it? Um, I don't know. That's a good question. It just shows it. Hang it from your mask. Hey, Autumn. I don't know. And yes, I'm on my iPhone right now because my main camera is in the car. Oh, it's like this. Oh, this gets cut off, right? Well, mom was like that. I know. Okay, here we go. Oh, so you can hang it over your neck, right. basically. Right. Which I see a lot of people hang them below yep. their ears anyway. Yep. Yeah. Say it all the time. Buffalo chick is my favorite. I saw I saw some kid at uh, my mask and I'm Walmart like, last night. Or yeah, yeah, last I night. I see him a lot on kids. I guess parents. No, 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 no. I'm saying some uh, kid had his mask on his chin like a diaper in South oh, Park. Jesus. It's like what the heck's the point of even wearing it if okay, you're not gonna wear it? The mask that I use at work is in my car, so I'll put this on it tomorrow. But yeah. That's nice. So you clip it on each end. It's plaid, right? Buffalo check or plaid. Oh, excuse me, right, Technical Autumn? Technical term is buffalo excuse plaid. Me. 
Very nice. But thank Enjoy. you very much. Thank you, Mandy. Appreciate it, Mandy. And I hope your family's doing well. Yes. I know you guys had a rough few months. Stay safe out there. Yeah, stay safe and stay healthy. That was underwhelming. <laughs> Sorry. And I'm home. Hey, Mal. What'd you do today? Nothing? My dude. All right. What's up, Z? What'd you do today? I know exactly what you did. He was inside his house all day just sleeping. I don't blame you, dude. It's been cold. Yeah. You're nice and warm. Enjoy. Guys, I am done. Thank you so much for listening to my rant and my mom's rant. My mom's not wrong, by the way. And I'm not just saying that because she's my mom, you know? I'm saying that because my mom has always been one of the most, if, if not the most, grateful, positive thinking person I've ever known. And like she said, I'm pretty sure I get that from her. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm a very positive thinking person. Like I said last night, with the whole Target thing, with no, no uh, Pokemon cards. Stupid example, but kind of a good example in a way. Um, my mom just said, dude, next, my next project. <laughs> Carrots out of like beads or something. Anyway, take a negative, turn it into a positive. If you're going to complain about something, at least follow it up with something positive. Something that promotes... Happiness, something that makes other people happy. Don't just say, underwhelmed. Okay, and your point? You're an attention-seeking person. Okay, cool. Uh, excellent. I mean, if that's the way you want to use social media, then you do you. You do you. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm, the, I'm the kind of person who likes to express my passion for the world, express my positivity, express my joy for things that I like to show on camera. From stupid things like milk. I love me some milk, baby. Want to make some sweet love later? To technology. I just think I'm a very fair person, you know? So I'm just going to end the vlog saying this. Are you the kind of person who wants to complain about everything in life and not take action? Not better yourself? Not work towards those goals? Or do you want to be a better person and actually work towards those goals? and making yourself a better person, achieving success. Because my, my whole back and forth thing on Twitter is a great example. I post something to inspire others to invest in Dogecoin. Of course, I get a few people, and they say as well, you need to have 10,000, no you don't. You don't need to have a lot of money to invest in something like Dogecoin. And yeah, maybe, maybe I should have put a disclaimer, but <clears throat> I'm not backing down when I say this. I don't need to put a financial disclaimer in every single tweet I post in relation to trading stocks, trading cryptocurrency, because you don't need a disclaimer. If you're a smart human being with even an ounce of common sense, and I say this in a respectful manner, then you know you're going to be investing wisely. It's no different than going to a casino and putting $100 into slots. Should you be investing money into those slot machines, into that poker table, into roulette? That's on you. That's not on me. That is always, always on you. However, me, as the content creator, I'm here to inspire. I'm here to help people try new things in this world. Because otherwise, if, if, if you don't take advice from others, you're never going to change. You're, like Every single day is going to be the same. And I realize not everyone has an exciting life. Hey, I don't have an exciting life. My week is going to consist of the same thing I do every week. I wake up. I make some coffee. I go on my iMac, I record some YouTube videos, I do my Pigeons Only vlog, I go to Goodwill maybe, go to Target, go to Walmart, but in that process, I try to motivate and I try to inspire. So that's all I'm trying to say, you know? Be a good person, think positively, and work towards your goals. Don't look for things to complain about. Look for things to improve. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a great, productive week ahead. Stay positive, and if you're negative, I'll just leave. Simple as that. I'll see you in my next video. Peace.